Hey guys, welcome back. This is my really simple snowball recipe. So all you need is one packet of plain biscuits. I'm using Mari. Um, some condensed milk, half a cup of coconut and extra for rolling, and one fourth of a cup of cocoa powder. Honestly, this is probably the easiest Christmas dessert you can ever make. This is probably the hardest bit is crushing up the biscuits. Now, I was silly and didn't use the food processor today, so I just decided to use the tin. So I'm also using my fingers to break it up. But make sure there's still some big chunks in there because if it's a really, really, really fun consistency sometimes it doesn't stick as well and this is what the biscuits look like when they're all crunched up there's some big pieces in there still but nice and fine so now all we have to do is add the rest of our ingredients to our biscuits. So I'm adding the cocoa powder first and then my coconut. Make sure you have some extra coconut because you'll need it for rolling and I'm just using a desiccated coconut. You can use shredded if you like but I just prefer desiccated. I'm just ensuring you mix all the dried ingredients together because otherwise you may get big chunks of coconut in one bit and big chunks of cocoa powder in another. Now you just want to add in your condensed milk. I absolutely love condensed milk, but you want to make sure you mix this in until the mixture is like a kind of wet sand consistency. If it's a little bit sticky, you can add some more biscuits if you like, but they normally firm up in the fridge. And this is what it should look like at the end when it's all mixed together. So now is the fun bit. When I was a kid, this was my favourite thing about helping doing Christmas treats because you get to get your hands dirty. So I'm just rolling them into little balls and then rolling them in the coconut and then placing them in a container. You can add as little as much coconut as you like and make the balls as big or small as you like. But just make sure that they're roughly the same size because otherwise they're huge. So once you've used all the mixture and rolled out all the balls, I like to place mine in the fridge for roughly two to four hours, but honestly, these don't last long in my house because they're so tasty. But if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up, and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye!